to my video about persuasion on netflix i'm doing a get ready with me so this is going to be my final look i just wanted to show you in the lighting look isn't this like so pretty but <laughs> i'm getting out of content anyways just keep watching to see how i do this makeup look and have me rant about how netflix persuasion wasn't really executed really nicely but thank you for i know press a like and subscribe video if you like the content and is there anything else yes my tiktok my instagram are linked in the bio if you want to just talk to me there and bye get me wrong it was a really really great movie i liked amazing quality i like the music choice like i go listen to the soundtrack sometimes when i'm bored um but i don't think anna and frederick should have ended up together so to start it off we start seeing anna like super depressed she's been super depressed because the greatest love of her life the person who she was madly in love with she broke up with him because of money because everybody around her was influencing him and it was years ago i think it was like over six years ago don't quote me on it but she broke up with him like over six years ago and you know she's been like depressed over it ever since like super depressed about it like never leaves her room and daydreams about him and what he's doing ever since she broke up with him first i want to start that off with that is so look i have so much dark spots i'm covering them up but that is so unhealthy like when i was watching it i was like so like no literally was depressed over him for so many years stop it get some help no <laughs> no so then i was like okay this is not gonna be the premise that was the premise of like literally half the movie that he was the one that got away and don't get me wrong yeah there's people who got away but over six years like she was pining after him for so for over six years like she never got over him like she never healed over him and i'm like it was it, it i like i understand the promise they were going for but i wish it was executed better because the entire time i was just like baby no like like the entire time i was they didn't set up the chemistry enough for me to be like no the entire time i was like baby no what are you what are you doing what what are you doing like, I feel like I know what they were going for. They were going for, like, the one that got away, like, story. And don't come for me. I didn't read books. But this is based on the movie that was on Netflix. Um, it, it just made me pity her. Like, I, I, like, they set the stage out of, like, pity. Like, I was just, like, I felt really bad for her. Like, I was just, like, I didn't want, I, like, entire time I was, like, before the movie, even, like, halfway through, I was, like, I don't want her to be with him. Like, I feel like... They set, I feel like the way they set up the movie, they set up the movie for her to like, for her to like, I, I don't know, they set up the movie for her to like, like, look like this strong, strong woman. Like, I thought that they were, that's what they were going for. Like, a very strong woman who knows her worth and knows what she wants. That's how they were like setting up her personality. The way they set up her personality and the way that they set up her actions were totally different she had the personality of like a strong independent woman but her actions were showing very like i don't want to say desperate but it was showing very mm, i'm still pining over a guy for so many years that i broke up with like i would understand if he was like the one who broke up with her but she broke up with him and i guess she like regretted it regret regret it but yeah i don't really like i didn't like the promise and then finally we meet him and i'm like okay i'm okay okay and he gives her a cold shoulder because yeah it was like six years if someone broke up with me literally because i didn't have the money yeah i'm not gonna be like mm, yeah, 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 with, i'm like gonna, i'm not gonna be like smiley smiley in your face but it was the fact that she was like yeah it was like your first love but he showed no like they they didn't even really have chemistry like that 
but he showed like no emotion towards her and look i get it she literally you know broke his heart for money but for what they were going for for like the one that got away like i expected more like he didn't even look, have like a look of endearment in her eyes like it just looked like pure hatred like not hatred but like it was close to it like and i don't know i don't know why the direction what direction they were going for but the entire face when they were they like acted together he was just like like that was his face and i was like why like what's going on like i i don't I, I was like i didn't feel the chemistry and i know dakota got like a lot of hate for this movie because i remember i love every romantic movie that comes on netflix i watch it and i remember a lot of people were like going crazy over it because they were like no this is not how it went in the book and because i i heard they were trying to switch it up because i heard like that's not how it like went in the book originally and like that's not how they they, they usually direct her movies jane austen but they were like like you know she had like this drama piece but they were going for like more like a comedy i don't want to say comedy but like that's what like it felt like and no part of that movie was comedy like no i liked her comment like her commentary it was like very nice like the way that she talked to the camera i was like when people like take that plunge and like break that fourth wall i think it's like amazing but other than that it's just like they had no chemistry and then it was one of the sisters which one which one of the sisters the the girl with the curly hair and him and her were really hitting it off and i thought she was such a sweet girl i was like she's such a sweet girl and i really liked the doctor that she was with what was what was his name i'm gonna, I'm gonna search it up right now and tell you what it was his, his name because he was let me see who mr william elliot i felt like they tried to make it seem like they didn't like end up together because you know they're like both different and like the ending spoiler alert he like was actually in love with the um the other lady i forgot her name too her name her name is not important but louisa louisa was such a sweet lady and i'm like louisa came to her asked her if it was okay and everything because you know they had like ex ex chemistry whatever i love louisa but the way they ended it with william and elliot like I said, not based on the books, based on the movie. I felt like they just threw him in with... What's that woman's name? I don't know. I don't know. And I don't know if find it. But I feel like in the end, they just threw that ending. Because just to throw it. To make it seem like, oh, he's like such... He's not like what he seems. He's been like leading her on. No. Like you couldn't find another way to establish that without him doing that like i feel like yeah they could have done much better i feel like Frederick and and i feel like Frederick and Anne had such a bad connection i don't want to say connection but they didn't have such a strong chemistry that the the way for them to break up Anne and william elliot because he was he was a really great guy and he understood her like that's why like he really understood her and he was a great guy and he understood her and i'm repeating that he understood her and i feel like whenever like two characters have like more chemistry than like regular characters they have to like diminish and like make them end in such a bad way like how i met your mother with barney barney like changed and like evolved and like because they wanted him her to end up with Ted so bad they spoiler alert for how I met my mother but they wanted her to end up with Ted so bad that they purposely like I don't want to say purposely but they like broke down their relationship like you know what I mean they they were great like everybody was rooting for them all the fans wanted them together and they're like no I already have like a set way that has to go and you know they ruined their relationship and yeah that sucked 
but back to like the movie i felt like it was more of that like I felt like they could have built it up her relationship with him more because all we saw was like clips from her view like her view on the relationship and she like described him as like this man of her dreams and stuff and if he was like they never showed that in the movie how he was the man of her dreams does that make sense I don't know if I'm making sense like they didn't establish like the background of us like in the beginning of the movie we saw them like looking out you know at the ocean and sitting at the beach and that's sweet or not but other than that they didn't really build up on that like when they met up with each other it was still kind of the same like they were still doing the whole like i don't know when they met each other like they still didn't have the chemistry and they still didn't really have the mm, like you know when you, whenever you see a couple on the street a, a couple in a movie and you're like wow like these people have chemistry like that's how i feel about the proposal i love that movie like that's one of my top movies because every time towards the end of it when um ryan was it it's not ben affleck what's his name you know who he is the deadpool guy when he comes and he like he talks to Sandra Bullock and I, I'm, I'm like everybody's just like kiss her. That's like the energy. Like they build it up. It was like such a slow burn, and I think that's what they were going for persuasion. Like such a slow burn, but I feel like for that to happen, you have to have at least some sort of like chemistry. Like at least have scenes where like they had scenes. They had scenes where they were looking long at each other, but like at least have more scenes where we they see them bond. Like. They had scenes, but it was, I don't know. I, I don't know if it's just me. I just wish it was more, mm. like, I wish I could, like, feel their chemistry on this. I don't want to compare. I don't really want to compare, but what was that, what was that show that was on Netflix that was, like, that old, um, like, old look to it, and what was that show? Let me find it on Netflix. Huh? Bridgmanton, Bridgmanton. Okay, so that's. I wasn't looking for it to be like Bridge Bridgmanton, but like that's the vibe that I got from it. And what was it? Was his name Sa Simon? It wasn't Simon and Daphne. Was it? It was Simon. It was. It, it couldn't be Simon. But their chemistry, like they went for kind of a slow burn with them, and. It was more like, I don't know, it was more natural and it progressed. Like, it was like the entire time you're like, oh, like, will they, won't they? And I wish the movie had went that type of direction with their chemistry. Like, you know, I don't know if I'm making sense. I don't know. I don't know if I'm making sense and you're going to be like, girl, you're not making sense. But I hope I'm making sense and you understand. I can't find my contour stick and I'm so sad. Where's my contour stick? I found my contour stick, but yeah, like the chemistry with Bridgmanton, like it felt so natural, like it moved and we progressed. And I just wish they had done that with Anne more. Like she just seemed so desperate for him. Like I wish she would have been like, hmm. like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want you, but it's like every time he gave her like an inch of attention, it was like, like wow and i'm like girl have some self-respect like that's it that's that's what i said in my head the entire time i watched the movie baby have some self-respect respect like it's not it's not that serious and i just i wish i know it could have been really really good like i know because both of them are amazing actors and it's like it could have been so good you know what i mean but i'm going to finish my makeup look and just speed through it so you could see what i'm doing and then i'll come right back mm -hmm. all right this is the final look oh my gosh like it's like sun outside and look how like really pretty this looks that's that's when you do really nice makeup 
but I really hope you like my video and if you have any questions just comment below if there's any other movie you would like me to review I will definitely check it out and if you have any questions about my makeup I will definitely link that in the description but yeah thank you for watching and press the like button subscribe if you like my video